Alright, so imagine you're going to the movies, right? So you and your group of friends have decided that it's finally time for y'all to spend some quality time together and just go out and have some fun. And while you're at it, you said it would be cool if y'all went to the movies. Now, what should you go watch? Maybe Oppenheimer, which actually goddamn delivers. That shit ain't overhyped one bit, that shit's actually awesome. Uh, maybe you want to go watch the new Mission Impossible, which I mean, fair, fair, you like action films, so why not? And then that one friend that nobody in the group knows how he made it past second grade, that one friend says, uh, let's go watch Barbie. Oh my god, bro. Oh, now, no offense to the people that actually went to watch that feminist propaganda movie, but tell me, was it really worth it? Yeah, I thought so. Anyways, I normally wouldn't put my opinion out there unless I knew a lot about a topic, unless I've seen stuff with my own eyes so that I can actually form a proper opinion on it. But not Barbie, guys. This is an exception. If you thought I was gonna go watch Barbie just so that I can decide whether or not it's a trash movie, y'all must be out of your minds. I mean, I would, but I cannot guarantee that I'm making it past the five minute mark. I'd storm out of that place faster than EDP445's career career died. But yeah, pretty much I've seen some reviews and heard just stupid shit about the movie overall, so there's no actual need for me to even watch it. But yesterday I came across this TikTok Barbie compilation and thought it would be funny to react to the crazy Barbie fans trying to justify the movie. So without any further ado, let's get straight into it. Ladies, I'm going as Barbie for Halloween. This is a PSA because I not only hope but expect everyone else to also go as Barbie of their choosing so that we can flood the streets, stirring the world into Barbie land and spend the night as various Barbies complimenting each other and yelling hi Barbie back and forth. Yes, queen, slay, slay, slay. Oh shit, now you're making the boys not want to look forward to Halloween. Just imagine the streets are flooded with blonde girls wearing pink and screaming, Hi, Barbie. Yes. Nah, but for real, it wouldn't actually be very different from your average day since most of women like these are plastic anyways and pretty goddamn annoying. That was obviously a joke, it made it seem like I hate women, which I obviously don't. Nah, jokes aside, I love women, I feel like everyone should, they can be the most precious things in the world, as well as most annoying. Bruh. Might I add, I have a girlfriend who would absolutely die for, but I just think that women trying to victimize themselves over and over again just ain't it, and this woke movie movies are just ruining the minds of young ladies that have huge potential to grow up into caring wives and mothers. And just don't get me started with the new Snow White film. Went into the Barbie movie thinking it was going to be tee hee giggle haha -ha, and was left crying hysterically questioning my existence, having a newfound sense of self and being eternally grateful to my mother. Uh yeah, that's a hundred percent everyone that went to watch the film. Nah, for real dude, this ain't it, she ain't gonna let you hit after this one. Oh, and by the way, all of these TikToks have the Billie Eilish song that goes something like this. What was I made for? Uh... So yeah, I had to put my own non-copyright music over it. Brother, at least, I don't know, put water or something in your eyes to make it seem like you actually cried. Cause this, once again, ain't it. You didn't cry as you obviously shouldn't <laughs> over such a dumb movie. What? I'm so confused. This video had the same music as the previous ones, but just she didn't say anything. Yup, she only opened her mouth and nothing came out. She pretended as if she was talking about something deep, but I guess we'll never actually know what she was saying because she decided to be left on mute. Mm -hmm. 
Not only are we doing everything wrong, but also everything is our fault. Barbie apologized to Ken for leading him on. Ken never apologized for stealing her house, brainwashing her friends, establishing a patriarchy. Uh, Barbie was the one responsible for picking Ken back up again, even though he hurt Barbie just as much, if not more. Ken never even acknowledged the fact that he had done those things to hurt her. Okay, so I can't really speak too much on this uh, one since I haven't watched the film, but I can just let y'all know. The film itself is so stupid if this actually happened and I've no idea why Ryan Gosling would be in such a garbage movie. Hollywood is ruining the minds of young women trying to make them believe that they're the victims of today's patriarchy uh, when in reality this is a big fat lie and if you went 50 years back none of the women would think like that. You would actually see happy families everywhere and nobody would be complaining. This is just rare nowadays especially in the west. Brother, I ain't reading all that. Why do they feel the need to write out a whole essay? If there's a lot on your mind, just speak for Christ's sake. The music in the background is pretty mid anyway, so you speaking would probably be way better for everyone. Anyways though, this was actually it for today and if you guys did somehow manage to uh, enjoy the video, then be sure to smack it a fat like, comment and subscribe. I'm trying to reach 2k subs by the end of the year and you subbing would help me out a lot. And with that said, be sure to join my Discord server where you'll get notified every time I upload since YouTube seems to just not care about that stuff and yeah I'm Medic I love you all and I'm out peace